Hello gorgeous peeps, I'm Chris from Techspert and today we're going to be checking out a smartwatch that doesn't actually look anything like a smartwatch. Slapped right here on my pale northern wrist is the Withens ScanWatch Horizon and it may just look like your bog standard premium wristwatch but it boasts some impressive features including some medically sanctioned ECG action and blood oxygen monitoring, full notifications, tracking, all that good stuff. However, this clever combination of spooge-worthy design and smartwatch style features does not come cheap. The ScanWatch Horizon will cost you just 5p under half a grand. And that's more expensive than your Apple Watches, your Samsung Galaxy Watches, all the premium smartwatches out there. So is it worth that rather steep asking price? Well, I've had it slapped on there for a good couple of weeks now. So here's my full in-depth ScanWatch Horizon review. And for more on the latest and greatest tech, please do plug subscribe and ding that notifications bell. Cheers. Now your first choice when you're picking up a scan watch is do you grab it in green or blue? Both of these models look very bright and vibrant in the official Withens photos, but actually the design is much more subtle in real life. I decided to go for the green model. It's quite a dark green overall, and that color's only really obvious when the light strikes the watch face as well. Otherwise it looks more like a moody silver, but I've got to say I really like the look of this thing. My only real complaint is that at 72 grams, the ScanWatch Horizon is a proper hefty morpho and it is quite chunky too, although thankfully it didn't look too ridiculous on my wafer thin wrists. Oh and also the luminous hands aren't particularly easy to see when it is pitch black, so two complaints I guess. Now it may look all fancy like, but the ScanWatch Horizon is actually tougher than Jason Statham wearing a suit of armour made entirely of miniature Bruce Lees. You got a stainless steel casing which is still in perfect nick two weeks on despite being banged about all over the place and likewise the surface of that glass may stick out above the bezel leaving it vulnerable to knocks but this is sapphire glass and therefore double hard. I am particularly cack handed at times especially when my blood isn't at least 50% caffeine so this thing gets banged off work surfaces, tables, all kinds of stuff and again that casing's absolutely pristine not a single scratch or nick on that glass so all good. And it's also water resistant to 10 atmospheres that's 100 meters so yeah you can take it on your snorkeling trip if you wanna. And if you do somehow still manage to f*** it up well the good news is that Withens has chucked in a five-year guarantee with the ScanWatch Horizon although you may want to check the small print see exactly what kind of crazy accidents are actually covered. The ScanWatch Horizon comes bundled with both this swanky metal band and also a fluoroelastomer effort which is better suited to outdoor excursions and exercise. I've got to say personally I reckon the metal band suits the watch much better. And as you kind of expect after spunking up half a grand you get all the necessary tools in order to remove links from that metal band including this very cute little hammer. You've even got a stand to slap the strap inside of when you knock seven bells out of it. Now to actually set up and connect to the ScanWatch Horizon you'll need to download Withens HealthMate app which is freely available on the Google Play Store and also the Apple App Store. The Bluetooth pairing process is incredibly quick and simple and the good news is if you do change your smartphone at any time well no worries just re-download the app it'll remember all of your information and the device courtesy of your account which you sign into and then it'll just pair back up again in a matter of seconds it's all good. And the app allows you to set up quite a lot of stuff on the smartwatch. So for instance, you can enable notifications and see exactly which apps will give you a little buzz on the wrist. You can set up common alarms on this bad boy. You can customize exactly what happens when you long push the button on the side of the scan watch. Play around with the brightness settings. I just left it on auto brightness because I found that worked perfectly well. And this is where you set up all of your health shenanigans as well, including your daily step goal. So the ScanWatch Horizon basically looks like your bog standard normal wristwatch until you give that dial a little push in and then all of a sudden the smart screen springs to life. This is a bright and crisp little P AMOLED display and it may be quite teeny so if you don't have the best eyesight in the world you might be struggling to read some of the smaller text that flashes up on it but personally I had no issues there and as I mentioned before the brightness level perfectly fine even for outdoor visibility. And in a neat little touch, when you turn on that display, the watch hands will temporarily bugger off to the sides if they are partially covering it, so no part of it will be obscured. Unlike standard smartwatches, you don't have any touchscreen controls here. Instead, you scroll through the various smart menu options using this rotating dial. Personally, I would have preferred it if the actual bezel of the watch rotated instead, because sometimes the dial can kind of catch against your skin when it's sat on your wrist and just makes it slightly awkward, but it's nothing too troublesome. And if we jump back into the HealthMate app, you can actually customize exactly which menu options pop up in that scrollable menu. 
pretty much any of them can be removed if you want. Most of them are health related, the likes of your heart rate monitor, your ECG option, your SPO2 workouts. And you can reorder the options if there's some you use more often than others. You know, I'm just scroll through the entire selection to get to them. And yeah, as you might imagine, the notification support is quite basic on the Withens ScanWatch Horizon, given it's only got that tiny little dinky screen to work with. But basically, for instance, if you get an email through, you'll get a quick flash of who sent the message and what the subject line is. And likewise, if you get a WhatsApp message, for instance, it'll just flash up the first bit of the message. So at least you've got an idea of whether whatever just buzzed in your pocket is worth pulling your smartphone out for, or whether you should just ignore it for now. The ScanWatch Horizon is quite lacking in a couple of areas compared with most of the smartwatches as well. So for instance, there's bug roll media controls on here. So if you are listening to a podcast, some music, whatever, you can't skip through tracks, raise the volume, lower the volume via the watch. You will have to yank your phone out your pocket and do it that way, the old fashioned way. Likewise, there's no speaker or microphone built into the ScanWatch Horizon, so you can't make or take calls via this thing and neither can you call on your smartphone's voice assistant. Now, as you can hopefully tell, there is a big emphasis on health monitoring here, with the heart monitoring being a particularly big part of the ScanWatch Horizon's appeal. For instance, this watch is capable of taking full ECG readings, which is something that other watches have attempted in a kind of a semi-successful venture. But here, it's actually properly implemented because the ScanWatch Horizon is medically certified for its ECG readings. There on the watch, you'll get a quick glimpse of a result, either normal or abnormal. And then over on your smartphone, you will get notifications saying your ECG results are ready to view. This will give you a full breakdown, including a nifty visual chart so you can see exactly what is going on. And you can also export these results as an actual health report, which you can then share with your doctor. The ScanWatch Horizon also supports 24-hour heart rate monitoring, and you've also got medical-grade SPO2 measurements on demand. And you can also track your workouts as well via the ScanWatch Horizon if you like. I've got it so a long press of the dial will automatically start up the exercise tracking. You've got support for around 30 different types of workout right here. You can select five of them for fast access via the watch. So I've just got a bit of walking and boxing. That's pretty much all I can get on with. Again, you can rearrange the order and everything. And when you're in the middle of a workout, just tap that dial button and you've got access to all the sort of obvious information you would need, such as the duration of the workout, uh, the actual distance covered if you are doing something like walking or running, current heart rate, and also the date if you want it. However, for anything like walking, running, etc., where distances and movement is involved, bear in mind you don't have built-in GPS here on the ScanWatch Horizon. It is connected GPS. So in other words, you'll need to be tethered to your smartphone via Bluetooth in order for that to work. And after you've completed your workout, it all gets synced up with the Health Mate app. You can give it a little tap and relive it if you like, including a full breakdown of your heart rate, whether you managed to get some good cardio on the go. But it's pretty basic stuff compared with some of the more dedicated fitness smartwatches. You could also keep track of your daily step count, how you managed on that each day, and your sleep score as well, because there is full sleep tracking support on the ScanWatch Horizon. Gotta say, like more smartwatches, not entirely accurate. Sometimes it thinks you're asleep when you've actually just been lying very, very still on the sofa. Other times it reckons you're awake when you are actually still basically passed out in bed, but it's, you know, it's there if you want it. But the vibrating alarm feature worked an absolute treat. That's really, really good if you want to wake yourself up with a very strong rumble on your wrist. Certainly it does the job, but you don't want to disturb your bed partner. And one of the reasons I really love the ScanWatch Horizon is because it doesn't have that massive energy drain and touch screen. That means the battery life is really solid. Withens reckons you can get around a month of use on a single charge of this thing. I thought it was closer to around sort of a fortnight or so, depending on obviously how often you make use of all the various health tracking apps, etc. But even that is really, really good compared with a lot of smartwatches these days, like the Apple Watch, the Samsung Galaxy Watch, you're charging those things every single night alongside your smartphone, which gets kind of tiresome. And obviously, if you forget to charge it up, then oops, I've got a watch for the day, hooray. And the actual charging dock itself isn't fantastic, but it is dinky, so at least you can just bung it in a bag, take it with you if you are going on an extended trip. But as I say, most holidays, you'll be able to get through on a single charge of this thing, no worries. And there you have it, that in a nutshell is the Widdens ScanWatch Horizon, a fantastic smartwatch that doesn't actually look like a smartwatch, it looks like a really nice premium wristwatch instead, but still packs quite a lot of smart functionality. And especially if you are interested in the heart monitoring side of things, this thing packs some serious smarts that most of the smartwatches can't touch. 
Of course, on the flip side, it also dawns come cheap, but Withens does offer a variety of other watches that are very similar to this, so definitely go check those out if your budget can't stretch up to 500 bloody quid, minus 5p. So that's what I think. What do you guys reckon? It'd be great to hear from you down in the comments below. Please do poke subscribe and ding that notifications bell for more on the latest and greatest tech, and have yourselves a ruddy, wonderful rest of the week. Cheers, everyone. Love you.